The gun violence between teens has a lot of people coming to the table trying to figure out how to stop it. Three Toledo teens have been killed already this year. Tonight, students are pleading with the people who have the power to stop their friends from dying. There have been vigils and meetings, one after the other, calling for the teen violence to stop. Now, kids are asking for help, for real action, to stop their friends from being killed. We see it on the news constantly, and to know that we're enabling such um, violence every day, and we're literally letting it slide is, is horrible to know. And I'm, I want to be part of the reason that there is change. Students Demand Action is a nationwide organization working to stop gun violence. These teens want the politicians from Toledo City Council to the State House to know they are frustrated. They can't yet vote for the change and help they desperately need. They feel powerless, unheard. We have to see on the news and hear about our friends um, being injured and being killed by guns every single day. And this happens to kids my age and this happens to kids younger than me. And to see this happen and to feel like I can't do anything about it is very, very frustrating. Violence interrupters are in Toledo neighborhoods working to form relationships to prevent the violence, but they also need help. It's an issue that has to be addressed right away. It's not something we can, um, we can just sit around and wait for um, results. Ohio Senator Paula Hicks Hudson from Toledo says it's time for the ones in power to talk to each other, stop pointing fingers, look at the programs that work, and fix what's not working. This atmosphere of chaos is affecting them and that we need to do something about it. You know, those of us who have the ability to make a difference, we need to take on and help them support and support them in ways in which they can feel safe. The group also points out black Americans are disproportionately impacted by gun violence. They experience 10 times the gun homicides, 18 times the gun assault injuries, and three times the fatal shootings by police than white Americans. All three teens killed this year in Toledo were black.